Greetings, and welcome to another video. And, yeah, today, I have a better camera. And I'm going to be reviewing this survival knife that I bought from Target. Now, it was $12, and so far, first glance, it's got a pretty decent leather sheath. It got some damage, it came with some, has some damages that it came with, but it seems decent. And the thread's coming loose. So let's hope the knife is yeah, at least on this level. So, first thing you notice, this sharp this part part right here has a sharpening stone. So, at least if the blade sucks, I can try doing some work on it. So let's look at the knife itself. Now, the reason I'm reviewing this is because there are supplies in the handle, so it counts as a survival kit. Now Handle, seem decent. Yeah, it fits enough in my hand. But, and, first glance, you got this bottle opener right here. So if you need to open any bottles, that any of the old school bottles that require it, yeah, that have bottle caps and need to have bottle openers. Yeah, then, the saw, these saw teeth. Now, notice, these saw teeth look a little weird. Which is probably because I should not be able to do this. Okay, so the saw teeth are pretty much worthless. The edge of the blade itself seems okay. And the tip, mm, not not that good. And it's got about an inch uh, gap right here between the you know, between the edge of the blade and the, uh, the uh, guard right here. So, but not on the knife, and since it has survived here in the handle, it's not. It clearly doesn't have much of a tang, which you can see right here if you look close enough. So, on the knife alone, it's not that good. But let's see what it's got in the handle and see if that makes up for it. Now, these there's some wires right here below the uh, cap of the handle. Not sure if that's yes yes if that's important or not, but guess we'll find out. No oh, stuff. Let's check the stuff in there. Okay. So let's see. Uh, yeah. First thing, get some matches, four of them, and a striker. That's good. Always a good idea to have uh, some uh, fi some fire starting item. Yeah, and matches are reliable, and I severely doubt you're going to be able to fit a, yeah, a lighter in there, and most ferrocerium rods that size are going to be pretty difficult to use, especially with something this big. Then, got it. Huh. Okay. We have some fishing line and a sewing needle. Now that's good, because a lot of threads, uh, threads actually would not be usable for sewing because they would just bond to your skin and could cause infection, but fishing line doesn't have that problem. And, it's got, and I just dropped it, and right here, we got a fishing hook with a uh, sinker. It's a fishing thing used to weigh down the line so that it gets deeper in the water. So, fishing kit, sewing kit, fire starters, and this. Hmm. Honestly, not sure what this is. Hmm. Oh, I get it. See, based on the description I read of the thing, I think this is supposed to be a wire saw. But, based on first glance alone, I can tell that this isn't going to be cutting anything. So, 
And I can tell right now that these rings that were on the outside of the knife are meant to be the handles. Yeah, for the wire saw. So, it's not gonna be cutting anything. So, it's a pretty bad wire saw. But... But, as for a review of the entire knife... Yeah, and yet yeah, all of this is the total in whole. Oh, forgot to mention this. There's a compass on the, in the handle. Seems decent enough. But so cutting out the wire saw, pun intended. We got fire starters, fishing and sewing kit, a, a cutting tool, and navigation. Honestly, it's a pretty decent kit. So, I mean, yeah, this is decent enough for basic first aid, so... You can count that as first aid. Honestly? If they, if they get put, and if they put in a better wire saw, considering that they're only about, about a dollar on, lot, dollar on Amazon, plus shipping... Yeah, this is a, this could be a pretty decent, this is, could be a much better kit, but on a scale of 1 to 10, as a survival kit, I'd give this about a 4. But as an EDC item, everyday carry, I'd rate this about a 6, 6 or 7. It's, yeah, decent. I mean, you yeah, know, you could just keep it on your belt. Or whatever you got. Yeah. Yeah. And. Yeah. This is good enough. Yeah, this is a good enough kit. Yeah, EDC item to where it's not worthless. I mean, is it worth the money? Mat four matches. You can get. Yeah, you can get. Yeah, you can get a few hundred of these at the dollar store for. You can get a few hundred of these at the dollar store for a dollar. But, and it comes with a striker, which would, which is also in the kit. Wire saw. Like I said, less than a, less than a dollar online. Fishing and, fishing and sewing kit. Yeah, now, admittedly, yeah, those are, yeah, a decent one of those is going to, yeah, could cost you a few dollars. But, yeah, I've seen fish sewing kits that are cost about, cost one dollar. Yeah, 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 and fishing kits. Yeah, that are really, yeah, really yeah, only a couple bucks, but, yeah, for the benefit of the doubt, I'll say it's a, yeah, a couple bucks. Yeah, then the knife itself, it's not that good, and, but the sheath and the fact that it has a decent edge would make up for that. But first, I'm going to, before, before I end this, I'm going to test the knife. I'm going to test the knife. Okay, so, first thing I'm going to test against is this uh, giant bubble wrap stuff that I came with. Okay, it cuts, and then this cardboard box that it came in. So, will it cut? Huh. Actually, it cuts pretty well. Now, stabbing. Stabs decently. Yeah, test the saw teeth. Like I said, it doesn't cut. Like I said, the saw teeth are pretty much useless. But the edge itself, honestly, pretty good. So, final opinion? Yeah, it's about a six or seven, maybe seven and a half. I mean, if I feel generous. But long term survival, but as a you know, survival kit, long term, two, maybe three stars. If I'm feeling generous. So, ultimately, worth the money? Yes. I mean, it's pretty cheap. But, as a, but as an add-on to a kit, or an EDC thing, starting, or something to start you know, collecting survival gear, this is excellent. So, thank you all for watching. Yeah, be sure to come tune in next time. I'm going to be looking into that uh, video that just yeah, showed up on my channel. I'm not entirely sure about that. Ignore the background noise. 
But I will see you all next time. Thank you all very much for watching. This is Random Man, signing off.